all across ONGC, the National Oil Company of India. Safety has always been the foremost concern as ONGC is primarily in the business of oil and gas, both of which are highly inflammable and dangerous. Safety first being the organization-wide motto, ONGC perseveres to upgrade and update its safety mechanisms round the clock at various installations and office complexes. In consonance with this thrust of safety, B193 Process Complex stands out as the lighthouse of safety, where state-of-the-art safety measures are in place in the face of all kinds of environmental adversity. Team B193 constantly takes inspiration from the countless legendary stories about tenacity and grit displayed in the face of adversity by former ONGCians and aims to emulate them with the adage, when the going gets tough, the tough get going. First platform to have been conceived and installed with the float over method, B193A process platform is a unique offshore installation for India and one of the largest such in the world in terms of ultrasar gas handling capacity. The platform is designed to produce 42,000 barrels of SAR liquid and 1.1 million standard cubic meters of gas per day. The SAR oil and gas production in the platform commenced in the year 2014. And since then, safe practices have been in place and followed meticulously on this unique platform, beginning with the arrival at Helitech. Designed to house a crew of 70, it has exemplary safety measures to handle all kinds of unwarranted eventuality for the safety of the men on board, as well as that of the infrastructure. With an installed offshore acid gas removal and acid gas disposal system, it can handle SAR gas of concentration as high as 40,000 ppm of H2S, an achievement unparalleled globally. But at this concentration of H2S, fatality can occur in seconds. Unique and exclusive initiatives taken on the platform include Fire and Safety Training Center, which has cut open models and displays of breathing apparatus, fire and gas detection system, helicopter rescue kit, knots and hitches, fire extinguishers, life raft, PPEs or personal protective equipment, deluge valve, different fireman suits. The center also has working models of fire extinguishing systems of all types, including foam, water, CO2 and DCP. Besides having fire tetrahedron and other visual aids, case studies of major disasters in offshore worldwide are briefed in the training center in order to make everyone aware of the importance of safety. The main objective of the fire safety training center is to provide hands-on experience of using water spray system, personnel basket, jumping rope, scramble net, life raft, hydrant monitor system for the personnel at the platform. Onboard crew is regularly trained to use life-saving appliances, firefighting systems, and various safety equipment like self-contained breathing apparatus and other PPEs. B193 has developed its own access control protocols, which include a buddy system and a docket card system for emergency mustering to ensure headcount of persons working in process area and to restrict unauthorized access. The platform has H2S Safe Shelter, a temporary refuge for people working in the high-risk area in case of unlikely event of release of toxic H2S and SO2 gas. The platform has emergency response stations in the field in which 
all firefighting safety and medical items are placed to cater to the emergency. Display of standard operating procedures is in place across the length and breadth of the process complex. Taking the lead in offshore, the platform conducts ambient air quality parameter survey every alternate month to ensure that ambient air parameters are well within limits for working personnel. Even mock drills are carried out at regular intervals to check the preparedness of any eventuality as per Offshore Petroleum Industry Training Organization OPITO standards and has become a way of life at B193. Be it human or mechanized resources, safety first has been and will continue to be the priority at B193 and across ONGC, which has always endeavored to care for all its assets throughout its timeline of existence.